going on guys? Welcome aboard Normandy. Welcome back for another Mighty Morphin Monday here on the channel. If you're excited for this one, do me a favor. Hit that like button down below. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this episode. Subscribe if you're new and check down in the description. There is a link over to my Patreon. You can get these episodes early for just $1 a month. All of them come early. Or for $3 a month or right now a free trial for one week, you can get the full length uncut reactions over there. Go check that out. Consider subscribing if it interests you. But guys, we are back with episode 14. No foul play in the air, I believe is what the episode is called. Or foul play in the air. Something like that. It's close. I just know episode 17 is when Tommy shows up. And that's what I'm really interested in. But not to, you know, downplay the importance of this episode. It could be a really good one. I'm going to go ahead and hit play. Check this one up, out because I have no idea what to expect with this one. Gotta rock out a little bit, right? What's life without a little metal in it? Yeah. Oh, by the way, go check out my buddy, Binge Worthy Gaming. I got his merch on here. Great guy. Go check him out. Well, starting to make more sense with the title since we're starting off with airplanes. Snizzard, isn't this, um, this is Brian Cranston, isn't it? Uh, unguarded drink. I've got the mind of a pilot. Oh yeah? What the hell does what that mean? Because Mr. Kaplan says I'm an airhead. <laughs> Maybe some other time. Well, your friends are welcome to go with us. But hey, Oh, thanks. Uncle Steve, Uncle you did not uh, read into yeah. um social cues. I've never been up in a plane this small before. It'd be interesting. I've been on plenty of flights before though. Yeah. I thought you both wanted to be pilots. I'm afraid of crashing. Mountains. He chose us to save the world. Are we really having a clip episode? You... We're only 14 episodes in and we're already having a clip show. What's wrong? You got roofied. His face like, this is actually like a legit murder attempt on Rita's part. Like, an effective one. She flies oh, a Zord. How does she not know what she's. Time. Doing if he flies. I think they picked the wrong one to put in danger for this episode. Capable girl, and the aircraft. And she flies a Zord. Her fuel supply is running dangerously low. They literally just took off. How convenient that Balkan skull passed out for this. Oh, oh, oh! They're awake. Oh look. Ah. Oh, now you wake up. Alright, so how, how is she going to help? Damn, Kimberly. Alright. Wow, good job, Kimberly. Uh-huh. Can't get one episode without that happening. Alright. Alright, guys. So, that was the first time I feel like where they legitimately made a focused episode on a particular ranger. And not only was the episode about that ranger, but that ranger was the most, like, the only one that was competent in the actual, like, fight. Um, everybody else just got their asses kicked, and then Kimberly came up, and she took out, like, 20 putties, and just killed the monsters, like, yep, yeah, I got this, I got this, <laughs> that was interesting, um, not a, the, the biggest logical inconsistency about her being able to pilot a sword, but not a regular plane, um, other than that, not bad, uh, kind of a nothing episode, but, you know, they're mostly gonna be that, uh, I guess the term for it would be filler, because there's no, like, going forward with, like, a major storyline or anything like that. But that's the majority of what this series is. Um, I don't know. I, not bad. Not great. Not going to stand out, but not going to be one of the ones that I'm like, oh, that was awful. Uh, guys, let me know what you thought down in the comments on that. I hope you have a good one, and I will see you next time. Peace.